Aquarius, and welcome to your Coffee Cup reading for the week ahead of January 20th through the 26th. And this is a very general reading for the sign of Aquarius. I want to mention my 2020 yearly readings have been extended to January 20th. I will not be extending them anymore. So this is the last shot to get one if you'd like up to January 20th. Okay, so let's get into your reading. Ooh, okay. Well, there's a lot going on. Remember, it's a general reading because the home foundation heart of the matter is it's a lot going on. Okay, so there's a lot of activity. Maybe there's some adjustments there or whatever's going on in your life. Um, you got strong energy. Yeah, you got the strength to get to uh, doing a lot of things. Maybe you're doing a lot of overtime. There's a lot of focus. You're working on something. Okay, and you have to be strong because you get so much going on. And it's like you're working, working, gaining, um, a lot of focus on that too. So there's something that you're working on for some of you. Maybe you're modeling, maybe you're changing some things. It could be in any area of your life. Um, I do see you're very hopeful, wishful, very nice. Hold on to your goals and your wishes and your dreams because I see for some of you, a uh, wish could be fulfilled within maybe next three months, if anything. So hold on to them. I do see uh, messages are going to be so important. Now, this is also good for like, because when we see messages and these days we're on social media. So if you're doing social media work or something like that, it's very good energy. This could be good news coming in. It's just very good energy, but good news. Also, there is travel, thoughts of travel. Maybe some of you will be traveling. Okay. So I do see that energy too, planning for travel, but, um, be careful, you know, slow down, make sure, um, I don't say anything bad. I'm just saying, just review things, okay? And I do see a lot of you reviewing things, you know, so you can see where, you know, so you don't make the same mistakes again. So I do see you kind of reminiscing the past or going back to, to apply it to present circumstances, okay? I see very creative energy coming through too. For some of you, this could be creative work. Maybe you'll start creating some, I don't know, videos or something for YouTube uh, or for, uh, I don't know, anything else. It doesn't have to be that. It could be maybe you're a web designer and there's, you know, there's a lot of creativity happening as well. Communication coming in as well. So creative energy, partnership, um, um, teamwork. I think that's the best way to say it. I do see there's a lot of responsibilities on you. It's like between home, work, okay? Some of you are too focused on finances, uh, watch the overspending, or maybe you're, it's, it's like some of you have this energy, it's like you want luxuries or you want to go over to, you know, shopping spree. So I would be careful of that thing before you do. I do see a lot of you counting your blessings. A lot of you are just reevaluating some things. It's like, mm, I'm tired of this. I want to do this and that. So there's like emotional choices maybe to make as well. Don't get stuck in some kind of a rut because I do see it's like a, a devil type of energy. So it feels like either you're going back to your own routines, bad habits. Don't do that. Don't let negative people or manip manipulative people put you down, make you feel bad. Something you need to break away from. OK, so it's like keep moving forward is the best way I can I can uh, say that, too. For some of you, this could be a love relationship or a person from, I don't know, the past or something where you feel so bound and attracted to um, could be even sexual energy. Um, I do see there could be a gathering. Home looks good, too. Like there's some kind of celebration. Happiness is happening. Um, I do see you've got a lot to get through. You've got the obstacles, but you'll get through them. You know, keep persevering. Stand your ground. Keep pushing forward. I do see that. Things are just a little bit of a process as well. But, you know, don't let your self-esteem or money worries or something like that get to you, okay? For some of you, this is the end of it. It's like now you're like, okay, I'm going to just, I'll be fine. I'm going to start um, planning for the future. Like if you overspent, okay, you know, you'll recover. That kind of energy too. Just watch. Um, not, you know, don't overfocus on money worries or that if that's you. So that's another thing I'm seeing here as well, okay? Now on the plate... A lot of you are closing up some chapters. There are some closings coming up. You're leaving some things behind. Some things that have been emotionally bothering you or some certain situations, It's you're just bye-bye. For others, this is almost like the universe stepping in and ending it for you, whether it's something that was, it was just not right for you. And maybe sometimes if we don't do it, sometimes the universe steps in and helps us. And maybe someone else like, 
end something for others. Someone maybe is walking away from you or you are doing it too. So I do see these changes and it's going to bring you luck. It's luck on your sides. So I'm seeing that. So wrapping things up, a lot of you could be um, reviewing the past. It's like, oh, and then, and then you're kind of finding some kind of closure, uh, so to speak. So a lot going on. You've got the strength to get through a lot. So you'll you know, kind of delegate your stuff to this week. But um, definitely seeing working and gaining too. And um, some changes with, I think, your home foundation as well. So, yeah. Okay, Aquarius. Um, this reading was for the week of January 20th through January 26th. And we are kicking off the Aquarius season. So, overall, happy birthday to all you wonderful Aquarians out there. And... I want to wish especially the ones that have a birthday this week from January 20th through the 26th, a very happy birthday, wonderful year ahead. Now, look out for the next video I will be doing. That's my birthday gift to you guys, a very general um, solar year birthday for Aquarius. Okay, so that should be coming up. And um, yeah, I'm going to try to do it today. <laughs> so that should be coming up. And yeah, so yeah, Aquarius season is here. Um, for the rest of you... I hope you have a wonderful week, and I will catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.